So the next thing is we'll try to create a simple intro and outro using a template. So assuming I want to create an intro and an outro video for my new channel, um, Epic AI. Okay, so I'm creating a new channel, Epic AI, and I want to create an intro for it using Clipchamp. So all you need to do is to make sure you're logged in and you can come to the templates over here. And you can see, like we've explained earlier, the range of templates that we have. And this time around, I'm interested in creating an intro and an outro. So let's go over to see all the intros, all the intros and the outros. So you can just navigate or hover over any of them to see the effect. Okay, so this is going to be very good as an outro. Oh, this is also going to be very good as an outro. So you can just uh, hover over them and you'll be able to see um, what kind of effect depending on what kind of channel or what you are trying to create. You can easily use this to just create your own. Uh, as you hover over, you'll be able to see the effect like I've explained. Okay, so let's say I want to use this simple one. So we just click as an intro. So we just look at the preview of what it is. So just this is an intro, just about seven seconds long. And you can say use this template to customize and and then you can uh, use it on your own. So now it's been imported into the uh, platform. Everything is being imported. As you can see, this very simple template that you see is a combination of different media footage over here, which I've dragged and dropped into the timeline. You can see them all. If I drag down here also, you can see we have other different kind of elements, including a mini video from here. So you can see them uh, all arranged here. This is the glitch electro electronic logo and then the glitch electronic logo also from here. So let's play a preview also to see how the different elements were arranged together to form that simple intro. So you can see the subscribe button, subscribe, like, this is my video. So you can just try to play and you can see everything. So I think it kind of looks nice and fantastic. And if you want to customize this to make it a very simple intro for your own channel, you can just come over here. If you click on any of them, for example, if you click on this, you'll be able to see the subscribe feature over here oh this is my video so let's say we want to customize this is my video you can just double click it and you can see the effect over here okay so this is my video for example we can say this is open open ai open ai as our own channel if you don't want the text that you have here the font style you can change it from here you can just check on the drop down and you will see a lot of different kind of fonts that you can assign to your text and i think this kind of looks cool to me if you want to have any you can just go ahead and check and edit accordingly so you can go back and try to see how you can play the preview also all right so because i wanted this to be an AI channel. So I wanted to put an image of an AI, something that can depict robots. Okay, so I can come to a website called Pixabay where I can search for some video footage that are royalty free. Okay, so you can, this is pixabay.com. You can come over here and I want to see uh, videos this time around. So I can just search for robots. Okay, so you can just search for anything robotic. And I think I kind of like this one for an intro. So you can just uh, hover over also, you will be able to see the preview if you want to see the preview of what it is. This is just uh, six seconds, but you can come over here as well and preview it. So you can see it. This is uh, a preview of what you have. If you are certain and you like what you see, you can just go ahead and download it and specify the sizing over here. I usually go for 1920 by 1080 and I just click on download. To download it and you can see it's just 1.8 megabyte all right so once you finish the download you can click here to locate it where it is being saved so you can just uh, copy it and then let's say we move to another folder where we have all this um let's say clip champ folder and then i paste it over here i paste my robots over here and then you can go back to the main editing platform and then you can import a media okay 
So this is where you can import the media. You can just click, go to ClipChamp. You can see it over here, robot. You can just uh, click and then you can install, you can import it directly. So while it is being imported, because it's just a six seconds video, you can just click on the add menu and it will add from the timeline, the position of this timeline. But this is not where I want it. I want it to replace this image of this woman with the computer. So I can just drag it and drop it over there. Okay. Okay. So you can see, I can just try to play it again and see because this is an artificial intelligence video so it's going to like form make meaning out of it As you can see yeah i think this looks cool to me yeah this is good so this is like the intro then we can start the video along the way if you want to shorten it also you can shorten it so this is the intro so you can change anything virtually if you want you can change anything and you can add anything depending on what you want you can add text also by just coming to text over here. You can add different kind of overlays. You can see as you hover over, you'll be able to see the effect that text is going to have. Okay. So assuming at this point, I may want to add a text at this point. Okay. I want to add something here. Say welcome to open AI. So I can just uh, hover over to select a given text. I feel like it can be very good for me. Okay, so let's say we we'll drag this one and drop it into the timeline. All right, here. So let's say we we'll drop it here and then maybe we can position it to this point. So let's try to, to zoom out and then see the position. So we can just come to the edge and just trim it a little bit to fit into the end. So let's see, we can come over here and move it to the side. And then you can play around with font style. If you want to change the font, you can also go ahead and change it. But I think this is okay for me. You can just reduce the sizing from the edge. Okay, so you can see it. And so we can just go ahead and try to play it. And let's see, but the text, I can customize it. So you can, you can click or you can come over here, select the text you can come over here and select and say, welcome to my channel. Okay, so welcome to my channel. So let's try to play it one more time just to have an understanding of what, it, what we are talking about. All right, I think this kind of looks cool. I think the last thing that is left is for us to export the intro video that we just made and then see a preview of it, how it's going to look like. So to export this, all you need is just to come at the top right over here to come to export and we just click on export. You can specify the quality over here. The video is going to be in MP4. You can have 480p, 720p, and you can go as far as 1080p, which is the HD format, okay? So we can go with HD, and it's going to start exporting immediately. So you can see it's exporting, rendering, and exporting. And you have the option to go ahead and share the link. You can copy the link and share it with people. So anyone with this link can watch the video directly. Or you can share it with your Google Drive, or you can upload to YouTube directly, or to send it to TikTok, to OneDrive, or to, to Dropbox, or to even Pinterest and LinkedIn account. Once you have them linked to this particular website. So it's very possible to do all this. And you can save to your computer directly you can have it here downloaded easily so you can just click around and then have a last preview of it so let's have a preview all right i think that does it for this tutorial i like what i see and i like the intro that i've just created so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next video